Hey everyone, so um, this is just a quick update on my um, recent install, my Vixen's Hair Imports install. Um, I recently had to take the hair out simply because, I don't know, it was really getting, um, it was really dry at the end and it was mostly just my longer length and, um, and I couldn't get a handle on what was wrong with it so I contacted the owner of Vixen Hair Imports and you know she was very very nice and apologetic about the situation and she thought that I was gonna get upset um, about the hair not really being manageable for me but I told her I was like look I do hair and there are times when you get a bad batch so I'm not gonna get upset because the hair is dry or whatever like it is what it is sometimes you get a bad batch but she was willing to um, replace my hair and I'm just waiting on that um, I know she was sold out of um, a lot of the hair and I know the hair she said to be won't be the same type that I had it's still gonna be Malaysian hair it just won't be the Malaysian wavy um, so I'm just waiting on that so for the time being I just had some hair that I had tried from a vendor um, a couple of months ago that I just installed on a U-part wig and I'm going to post the video of um, how I ombre or dyed the hair and that's the hair that I have and I just have it in a, a ponytail right now simply because I haven't straightened it so it's kind of like wild <laughs> right now but um, yeah I don't have any ill feelings towards the Vixen's hair imports. I'm actually excited to you know to still try the hair and I'm glad that she was able to you know replace my hair and you know and I know she was probably excited that I was understanding I wasn't gonna be upset or be like you know you gave me bad hair no because once in a while you know with any hair company it doesn't matter if it's Vixen's hair imports or any other hair company it's like a you know a risk type of a thing like sometimes you'll get a bad batch of hair and sometimes you'll have a great experience so just know that when you're buying hair whether it's from a Chinese vendor or an American vendor you know always have that thought in the back of your mind that not every hair is going to be a hundred percent perfect all the time every single time you order you know so think twice before you kind of lash out at some of these unless you keep having people sending you know a lot of their customers bad hair which i haven't seen from the hair that she sent to other people so i just feel like maybe i just got a bad batch or a bad bundle in, within my hair so i'm just glad that i'm able to get it replaced um but that's it so I'll do a video once um I get my new batch of hair in and it's gonna probably won't install it till hmm maybe after Christmas maybe before I don't know we'll see I have to treat it and all that stuff make my you part so we'll see how I'm feeling about the hair that I have in now if I feel like changing it sometimes I get lazy <laughs> um but other than that, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to update you guys. That's why you haven't seen any updated videos um, about the hair so far. So, um, yeah, I just wanted to share with you guys what was going on. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye.